2018 marks the 10th anniversary of the Joint Laboratory for Biosafety established by CABI and the Chinese Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Affairs. After a decade of cooperation and knowledge sharing, the Joint Lab has achieved a huge amount to address Chinese and global needs for food and nutritional security, food safety, greater innovation and sustainable development. Vital to the establishment of the Joint Lab was China's membership of CABI in 1995. Since then, key developments have built a close and fruitful relationship across a wide range of areas, including information and knowledge management, scientific research and international development in agriculture and the environment. The function of the Joint Lab is to provide a platform for research and development collaboration, a centre for training and scientific exchange, an open platform for joint collaboration with third parties and a consultancy service for the Chinese government. The main research areas for the Joint Lab include integrated pest management and biological control technologies, prevention and control of invasive alien species, biopesticide research and development, reduction of chemical pesticide residues, and environmental safety research into transgenic organisms. Key highlights and achievements of the Joint Lab over its 10 years of operation at the Institute of Plant Protection of the Chinese Academy of Agricultural Sciences include introducing advanced biological control technologies to manage major crop insect pests in China, benefiting agricultural development in the country. For example, the importation of a biological control agent from Europe to China to control mirrored bug a serious cotton pest. Collaborating with PlantWise has promoted integrated pest management and sustainable use of pesticides, which is helping the Chinese government achieve its target of zero pesticides growth by 2020. The Joint Lab delivers multiple international projects to promote North-South and South-South cooperation. To date, over 10 major international projects have been successfully won with a combined funding amount of around 13 million US dollars. It participates on the global stage by organizing major international events and training hundreds of people from different countries on integrated pest management and biological control. In addition, it publishes world-class scientific research with numerous peer-reviewed papers in prestigious SCI journals, along with books and national patents. Two recent projects, supported by DG Devco EuropeAid and the Chinese Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Affairs, have helped smallholder farmers in Laos, Myanmar and southwest China to increase their rice and maize production sustainably using solutions suited to local conditions. The projects involved the establishment of biocontrol mass rearing facilities and training of farmers and extension workers on integrated pest management, resulting in significant rice and maize yield increases. The project was awarded the second Science and Technology Progress Award by Dehong Prefecture Government, Yunnan Province. The Joint Lab Team has also been recognised. In 2011, Professor Wu Kong Min, the co-director of the Joint Lab between 2008 and 2013, was elected Academician of the Chinese Academy of Engineering. In 2012, he was promoted to Vice President of the Chinese Academy of Agricultural Sciences. Professor Wu's successor, the current co-director, Professor Zhou Zhu Ping, won the prestigious Herlang Herli Foundation Prize in 2017 and Fellow of the American Phytopathological Society in July 2018. Dr. Uli Kuhlman, CABI's co-director of the Joint Lab, received a Friendship Award from the Chinese government in 2012 and an International Friends Award from the Chinese Academy of Agricultural Sciences in 2017. The Joint Lab's relevance and contribution to China's future agricultural and economic development will continue as China leads the way in South-South cooperation and technology transfer. Important Chinese initiatives, such as the Belt and Road, 
and Chinese agricultural technology going global will provide the joint lab with future opportunities to function as an open platform for multilateral collaboration, particularly among CABI member countries. Under the umbrella of the joint lab, in 2018, the first European joint laboratory was established in Switzerland by China and CABI. The close partnership will create a new approach to research in agricultural science and technology, shaping Europe's agricultural future. The outstanding achievements by the Joint Lab to date were made possible thanks to the strong political and financial support from the Chinese government and CABI. Sound management and strategic direction has been provided by the Steering Committee, supported by the Technical Advisory Group, all underpinned by a world-class team of staff and co-directors, with support from liaison secretaries. The Joint Lab would like to thank all of its funders, partners, staff and supporters for their valued contributions and delivering so many successes over the last 10 years.